previously on State of Decay 2. That's the spot we're looking for. Those hostiles. It's time for you to die. Watch the barrel. Got a barrel. Oh, to Feral. Got him. Love it. Love it. Oh, saved his ass. Lovely. All right, speaking of saving ass, let's go the bloater. Right in the baby. Fucking horde is on us. Oh, slug him in the back. Won't work. Oh, armless dude. Hey guys, welcome back to State of Decay 2. We are going to, I guess, just continue raiding everything in this area before we move. That's pretty much our next goal is, is getting the F out of this area because very limited with what we can do with the space. It's a very more of a defense base. Um so we need to look for space uh, look for a space that we can actually build more on. So I think there's only like a couple spots that we can build in this. And it's so far we can't continue our game, our main missions. At this base. Uh, is it here? Is it this? I'm sure we'll find a ton of stuff in here worth bringing back. Oh, eight. He's not lying. He is not lying. I'm happy so far as all the doors are functioning properly. They're not locked. I like that. Yeah. First door, we get a rucksack. Not a bad deal. We have that bloater though, outside of the building. Pockets are slowly building up here. Don't really want to do fast search completely yet, because that is a lot to carry. I feel like we're gonna trigger something. Oh. I've sensed like they know that we're here because I hear them. Always creepy. Always creepy. Another rucksack. Oh, bloater just exploded. Got tired of waiting for us. Oh, he's dumb. You know, he could just use this open door. You like that? <gasps> oh, Jesus Christ. I doubt there's anything good in here. Well, I was going to go attack him, but apparently he's got a buddy. Wow. Off with their heads. The heads literally went rolling. Man, this dude is just so lethal with a sword. We can't really partake in there yet because we have to go get the vehicle. We start strafing too far away. Uh, we have one more. Oh, toolkits. Always lovely. Always lovely. Then we got this materials rucksack. We'll slap on our back. They were a terrible thing to have these. Uh, do we have a lot of them, though? That's the question. When the government asked West and Ally to deliver food to refugee camps, we said, hell yes. And when people ask if Red Talon's gonna finish this fight, I give him the same answer. We do have a lot of them, so we're just gonna do that. And... Perfect. Oh, that made a lot of noise. Uh, what else do we have? So the horde over here... We're gonna go back to that factory, because that factory, even though we cleared it out... For whatever reason... It decided, where's the horde? It decided to say that it was not completed. 
which is kind of rude. Oh, there they are. Bloater ahead. Watch it. Where is the bloater? Oh, I love that. It just takes off their head. So fantastic. Where is the bloater at? They acknowledge the bloater. Oh, he's like quite a ways away. Ain't wasting my time with that. Nowhere near. Is there anything random in here? I'm not sure if a tent is, constitutes as a building. Is that what's triggering it? The room that they tried to go in earlier? Keep quiet anyway. Shit. So much for being quiet. Yeah, exactly. That was like perfect timing. Okay, we're now we're gonna have to deal with it. Oh, just these the one man murdering machine. What the hell? These two are just they're witnessing this act of greatness. Wow, this guy, this guy, man, if I can give everybody that, like, leg sweep thing that he does, man. Oh, another toolkit. Fantastic. Super lucrative runs lately. can't take care of this on my own, but some help would be, yeah, acceptable. Uh, where are you at? Hope you're nearby. Oh shit, so you're like in an area that we haven't been in like forever. I think that was where Mickey's place was. The horse surgeons, so another hostel has moved in over there. Didn't we just kill somebody in the last episode in that building? Uh... I think you're fine. We're gonna go here for now. Because we're here. Let's continue raiding this. I don't think we ever got in here. This is a very tall factory. Or warehouse. Alright, we got some cat food. Go here. Alright, did we get any chemicals? Sounds like we're gonna get some chemicals. Yes, got a case of chemicals. Always a good thing, especially if you want to brew beer and then sell it. This game is just so many levels, it's ridiculous. I'm also tempted, oh, another case of chemicals. Almost tempted to change from like builder to something else. I don't think you could change it in the native game. But with mods, like the developer menus, you could kind of change whatever you want these players to be as their uh, the leader. Oh, another thing. Oh, wait, there's more. Yep, that's not good. They'll see all these bodies here and they'll know what's up. Got some dead heads here. <laughs> You ain't going anywhere. You either. Just make it easy for I, I feel like I should just do that from now on. Go after all of them, take out all their legs, and then uh, just leave them all on the ground for everybody just to behead them. All right, now let's go see. Oh, it's a screamer. Yeah, screw it. We're going to go over here. We're going to go see them. So the best way... To go over there, get the main road, main drag, and just make a right and then left. I got you. I'm headed your way now. You're the best. I'm the best around. No one's ever gonna keep me down. Oh, he just jumped to the front seat. Okay. I was making sure that everybody was in the car. And now we're venturing to other parts that we haven't been to in quite a while. Oh, I remember this. This is very difficult to go through here. Then we have like a plague heart, I think, at one point in this area as well. I think there's a plague heart over here on the left. Like when that barn. Knock, knock. Guess who? Knock, knock. Oh, there's a dark helmet. Alright boys, let's do the deal. Yeah, you can't do anything to anybody now. Hey, Gimpy. 
Oh. Oh. Oh, that was a vicious way to behead him. They usually just kind of chop it from the side. Guillotine style. Not at the forehead. I wonder if that guy needs any help. I think it's a girl. Excuse me, Sergio. Jesus Christ. Hey there. Hi. Can you walk over here? Brown toe cast. More of the same. More of the same. Uh, what you need help with, Lindsay? This crazy ex Red Talon guy just swooped in and took over my old team. They're all nuts now. Please help me take them out without hurting my friends. Uh, are you gonna tell me who they are? We're accepting without knowing. I guarantee you, the scattered survivors. Didn't we just do something with them a little while ago? The lonely dude's campsite. I thought we just did something with scattered survivors. They're like literally scattered everywhere, aren't they? Oh, just so much. Break open this. Let's break open this one. I forgot that you can do it from this. Good deal. Bunch of materials. Uh, we got everything? Go. Everybody get on the bus. Uh, where are the lonely dudes campsite? And kill the man in the red talon mask. Is it here? The horse surgeons? Is, is this going to tell us? Oh, right here. Okay, I do like these. I do like these that we can do different things every now and again. Especially when it's just random ambient things. Really dig it, because sometimes when you start this game, uh, you got nothing to do. You got to kind of wait for things to pop off a little bit. All right, more materials. So let's go here. Let's try to wipe this whole corner out. Is it this building? Yes, it is. And another, another door that's easy to open. Shocked. Oh, no, that's not easy, though. That seems to be happening a lot this episode. Just waiting for Juggernaut to start freaking out. Oh, we got one. Oh, he's wearing a cone. There's the cone head. Oh, in the back of the head. Yeah, looks like I won't be on your menu today. Wow. Uh, where is Lindsay at? Is she staying here? Is that what we're doing? We're doing your bidding. Well, that's just rude. Uh, can we go this way? There's no trail or anything that we can go through. Oh, these rocks are going to be the death of me. Not anymore. She didn't pay her Uber. Uh, back here. Here we go. So we killed a man with a mask. I hope he saw that. So he doesn't have a mask on. What's this guy doing? You gonna feel for ugly there, bud? I killed a man with a mask. What the hell happened in there? Like a zombie exploded? What the hell? You guys need to go back. Oh, we get to go back. Good deal. So I guess we could finish looting. That's the name of the game. State of Looting 2. Slow down. Guess we can do Overwatch, right? If he doesn't want to join us that way inside the vehicle. We can at least make sure that he makes it. Thought there was two of them though. I don't know what the other one is. Oh, he can handle himself. Jesus Christ. I do like this thing where like they just kind of run down the road. Where are you going there, bud? Oh. 
this member mid city. All right, you're easy to kill. Take this other helmet dude down. A lot easier to kill when you can't move. Oh, <laughs> that was gross, but also very enjoyable. Those two of them. Man, gets me every time. Oh, so are they. 100%. They're definitely beaten to a pulp. So I think he's made it. And I'm not sure where the other one was. I thought there was two. I thought there was three of them. And we killed that leader. Or so-called leader. And man, like leaving the wake of all my dead bodies everywhere. We're home. Uh, so one of you. Oh, no, you both are here. I guess the other one hauled ass. You're all right in my book. So he's finally gone. Yes, good luck putting the pieces back together. Hey, I want you to have this. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Hey, what's up? Come on, make yourself at home. Oh, uh, I think we already did. Right, so I guess we'll head back to the base, reconvene there. Oh, I forget that these guys have like awesome hearing abilities. So they are now allies. So is it this little little area here? Got nothing to click on. Oh, just love it. That never gets old. Uh, so I guess we can't need food. Um. Okay. Well. Guess we'll head back to base. This has been a very fruitful morning. Good thing is we don't have to go far. Oh, don't run into it. Man, this guy is just super fantastic. Taking them out, taking their legs out, really cripples them, like literally and figuratively. Because they can't do anything. And even if it's just a knockdown temporarily, man, they just can't do anything. They just absolutely can't do anything when they're crawling all on the ground. Alright, not a bad day overall. Using the old truck seemed to be very beneficial. We'll catch you in the next episode of State of Decay 2. Alright guys, have a good weekend. Later. What up everyone? I'm back.